what is going on crew ralph back in the old ford with art in lawn care crew my crew my crew equipment defender has hooked me up well let me take that back not just equipment defender Danny is it Lanier La Laner Laner La Danny Laner Danny Laner I won his giveaway of a sure can and an equipment defender gas can rack for it. I've never messed with a sure can before, but I have messed with equipment defender. Everybody knows that. So, um, he got that sent out to me. Equipment defender hooked me up with a sprayer rack. It's made like their blower racks to put in my enclosed trailer. Uh, so I've got those two things in the back updated now um, This is pretty much a journey this year of me putting my Enclosed trailer together to show you how I use things. I'll put it in spots that I think You know Benefit me well on the yards that I mow how my setup goes on how I use stuff um, I did take out the 33 Craftsman uh, walk behind. Uh, found out that it was faster for me to use my 21 inch mower, a little Troy built. That's right, you heard me. I got me a Troy built push mower, baby. Running the crew with the Troy built push mower. I don't mind push mowing, I like it. I think it has a little bit better quality than the Craftsman 33. The Craftsman 33 is a whole lot better for time. But like I said, I think I do better with the 21. It looks better and, you know, I feel like I get it done almost as fast or even faster. So, uh, plus I got a bagger for it and a shoot, launcher, blah, blah, blah. So I've been using that thing. It's the key start. We ain't pulling strings around here. We innovative. We got a key start on a 21 inch push mower. So that baby's in the back. Uh, you know, I'm still running my Tiger Cat 2, the big 52 inch. Uh, thing is amazing. I love it. I did have problems with the, uh, I'm trying to figure my words out here. Uh, my roller kit, my striping kit the factory one that comes from Skag with it. I had a few problems with it, figured those out, because them things take a beating, rolling on the ground all the time. So uh, I got that thing fixed on there, and she is mwah, beautiful, beautiful. Making them stripes, looking pretty. Plus I got the old 52 inch walk behind, key start, all that beautifulness. I'm Skag poor. I am Skag poor, I love it. Uh, love it. Yeah. Uh, I've got the uh, Echo 280T. Uh, you know, the uh, weed eater. Gosh, my, I can't get my words together today. Got the old S. Is it S? Whatever. It's 90. FS90. That's what it is. FS90 R Steel. My gosh, when you get off of work and you're hyper and you want to get out, you know, you're just having a good day. It's great. <laughs> oh, Lord of mercy. Just so excited today for some reason. But I got that. I'm running it. Believe I'm going to put the old Husqvarna Edger up for sale. That way I can look at something else. Uh, bought me a couple of little new toys that I haven't showed. And I'm gonna go ahead and tell you what they are. I got me a Ryobi electric chainsaw. Because why not? And they're awesome because I don't use a chainsaw that much. Uh, sold my gas hedge trimmer. Got me a electric Echo, I think it's 24 inch bar hedge trimmer. Haven't got to try it out. I'm wanting to try that out for everybody. Uh, 
of course, everybody knows I have the Murray handheld blower. Getting rid of that thing. I don't like it. It's more for homeowner, and I figured it'd be a quick, easy fix for what I was using it for. Nah. Nah. Unless you're a homeowner and you've got time to fiddle with it, don't buy the Murray handheld blower. I don't know the exact numbers on it. A junk, a junk, a junk, a junk. Uh, running off that, but I'll go in the back of the trailer here in a little while and uh, show you the equipment defender setup because that's pretty much what this video's about. I'm talking about my setup. I'm going to do a another setup video because me and Nathan's changed so much stuff around since the first of the season when we done our first video. So that's going to be coming up. Never thought I'd go back to Ford and I did and I love it. Can't complain. Make fun of me. Make fun of me. Make fun of me, Chevy guys. I still like my Chevys. I still like my Fords. I'm gonna shut my mouth because I've been sitting here talking for like six minutes, excited as I'll get out. Blah, 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 blah. So uh, we're gonna get out, get you in the back of the trailer and uh, show you the equipment defender stuff I like. Here it comes. What is going on here? In the back of my trailer now. Figured I would uh, show you a little update on this yard. Cause looks like it's gonna rain here in a little bit. I ain't calling for it today, but you never know. You might get a pop-up storm. Gonna mow with the uh, those skag area, the zero turn. Been mowing with that thing all day, baby. Yeah. And uh, of course we got. You thought I might have been lying. Got the old Troy built right there. <laughs> oh. Anybody wanna buy a Murray if it's close to me, let me know. I'll show you. But I was gonna show you little bit of the upgraded stuff in the trailer. Uh, of course, you've all seen my trimmer racks. Gonna be putting an old edger up for sale too. Thing cranks like a dream. Got the tool rack by Equipment Defender right here. Stuff full of tools. Uh, my shelves are nasty. Got all kind of junk in there. There's the old Ryobi chainsaw and the Echo Hedge Trimmer. I'm gonna have to get you some video on that. Thanks to old Lanier, like I said, though sure can with the uh, the Equipment Defender rack, which is all. Let me set you up over here real quick. Well, that's a little too far away. I don't know if I can do this one-handed. You actually gotta, I gotta hold it where it don't smack the wall here. But uh, just like that, and uh, that thing comes up. And it's got such a tough spring, it's like all in your wallet. You gotta be careful with it, okay? That's all I'm saying. Keeps everything seated. Five gallon gas, it's actually filled up. On the wall, I was gonna actually uh, do y'all some video on uh, how to install this stuff, but my camera footage got corrupted. So there that is. There's a little closing mechanism for it. I actually love, love that setup. I didn't go up any higher. I was gonna do like b and uh, Long Carol Blake. Set it up there, put a hose on this to fill up my mowers and stuff, but eh, I like it there. It's out of the way. And, uh, got this from Equipment Defender the other day. Freaking love this thing. Uh, had this for almost a month now. Almost a month. Uh, like I say, I do not, I do not spray for anybody. Uh, I do it just for a couple of people for free, just to help them out their driveways and stuff. And I just use Lowe's brand weed killer. Throw it in there, spray. So there it is mounted up. I done the same thing with this one as I did with this rack. I forgot 
TV video, this one, this one got corrupted though. But uh, there's one thing that I had to switch around on it for this sprayer. I had to run the cable actually the opposite way instead of the other way to flip down over it. And uh, just pretty much set everything in there. It actually stays where it needs to be, set it up how I needed it and how I wanted it. Uh, so there, this is pretty nice. I mean, it's just like the blower rack, a little bit smaller than the blower rack, I think, from uh, looking at Nathan's and looking at this. So, I mean, it's got a little gap on the wall, nothing major, but uh, Here we go. pretty nice, man. I like it. I like it, Curry. You can't beat it. Keeps everything out of the way. You can't fuss about it. Can't whine about it. It gets it up off the floor out of my way. And, uh, can't beat it, man. You can't beat it. Nice racks. Love equipment defender racks. You can't beat them for me. Y'all know I like them. I love them. And uh, that's what I'm gonna go with. If you don't want them, don't buy them. Okay. Just tell you. I love them. I'm telling you what I like. And by gosh. I mean, just coming back here, looking in there. I need me some blower racks for this side. I ain't gonna lie. Need some blower racks for this side. Looks sort of bare over here. Oh, it got me a bagger from my, my Troy belt too. But coming along with the equipment defender stuff, I can tell you that. Love it. Love it, man. This tool rack, lifesaver lifesaver uh gets everything up and out of the way i mean as you can tell i'm carrying a shovel an edger rake another rake uh loppers uh just i mean all kinds of stuff still using the ego battery backpack blower also uh it comes few and far between on stuff but uh next project is get this old baby into a rack on this wall. That's my next, that's my next thing. Possibly getting that put up on the wall too. So uh, that's pretty much it for this video. I appreciate it. Yeah. <laughs> appreciate y'all. Stopping by, checking us out. If you're not a crew member, listen, if you're not a crew member, the subscription button's 100% free. Smack that subscription button down there because you become part of the crew. And there ain't nothing better than becoming part of the crew. <laughs> but if you watch our videos, you are 50% more attractive if you watch our videos and subscribe, I guarantee you you're 100% more attractive. Guarantee it. Well, I am gonna come out here and mow this property down over here where we're going to be uh, annex. So, like I said, I appreciate y'all joining us. Thank you so much. We'll catch y'all out there showing us what's going on in your trailer. Absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. If you don't like it, sorry.